Teams for this exhibition match. No, I don't mind if I'm taking that match. What? I know. <laughs> Players anxiously waiting. Come on, we have to pay for it. This game. I'm about five years from home. That's the way I'm starting to start. Here, anyway. Everyone said he was his own. Come on, we have to pay for it. Veteran player, Barney Carroll. In his 15th season as a professional footballer. We'll be showing these youngsters what it's all about and a few tricks as well, I'd say. And that delicate touch on the ball. Are you alright, Annie? You could be a goal for us. I know, Kills could be the goal. Take off Jim, your jumper. Jump <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's have the toss up now. Now, you go ahead, Greg. Right. Careful. Yeah. Yeah. So you first pick. Yeah. You second pick. Yeah. Oh. You play, Brian. Oh, no. He's, he, he has to. Sure. He has to do it. I wish you would play, Brian. No, I won't be able to see it afterwards. Dave, Dave, you're right, picking. Okay. Oh, right, you can have an extra one for Could me. So okay. pick again. Steve, Steve and John. Steve and Cahill, is it? Steve and Cahill. You're going to take off the shoes. Here, Graham, I'm with you. Who are you with? No, you pick Jenna. Dad? Jenna. You're with us. I don't think any others should be. And now we're getting ready for this kickoff. And now we have this man, David Carroll, playing a blinder. And now we have Carroll working his way down the wing with the ball. Somebody in the middle looking for a cross. Graham has a shot. Oh, well, very, very close. Almost the first goal. What a good blinding save there from Parry Carroll between the posts today. A nice ball across with Graham looking for a goal. Oh! A goal! What a goal there from Graham Clark. First goal of the game after about a minute's play. <laughs> and now the kick off. The cameraman gets a kick. <laughs> Just don't hit me with it anyway. And now we have to... This man Cahill is on the ball again. And that was just wide. And here's the man we're all watching today, young David Carroll. A very promising future in the game, I would think. But closely watched by Graham Clark. Now, let's see what's happening here. Gemma's on the ball, but she's robbed by Carl, and that's the second one. That one nipped, nipped past Pori Carroll very easily indeed. He didn't get down quick enough to that one at all. This is Graham Clark, and another goal has gone in. Jeepers, that was quick. Straight from the tip off. They lost possession. Graham Clark pounced on it 
and slotted past the unwary Harry Carroll. Well, the old goalkeeping record isn't really standing up to its test today. Three goals gone by and seven minutes gone in the game. So there's a restructuring of, of the tactics for the rest of this match, I would think. Now let's see what's going on now. Stephen Clark on the ball. Working his way around. He's dispossessed by John Moore. And now David Carroll has the ball. He's working his way around. And oh, almost in. Very, very close. But it looks like a corner. Call to take the corner. He'll be looking to chip this this in for the for the oncoming David Carroll. But the ball is, is, is a scrappy goal mouth attempt. Hold on, the referee is calling for a handball. Now let's see what's going to happen at this. It's a free in. Come on, up the score from Manor. Manor. Oh, Manor team trying to open the score here. As Cahill takes the shot. Oh, and that's one. That's one back. 3 1. Well played shot. Into the corner. Giving the keeper, Siobhan Moore, no chance. Back again. Stephen. Don't stop. Here's this man, again, playing absolutely devastating stuff. Oh, it's a great save by Siobhan Moore. Referee's called for the corner, corner, and a corner it's going to be. So now, can something come from this? The ball is knocked into the square again. But it's taken clear by Stephen Clark. Stephen Clark working his way up, and it's Graham Clark. He's only got party card to beat the goal. Oh, and it's a great save from Carroll. Now, who's got the ball? Stephen has it. He's trying to cross it in. Cross it in, and Parry Carr just slaps it by the post there. Great goalkeeper, but it's a corner. Graham Clark is on the ball. John Moore, who's taking the corner? What is happening over there? The referee places the ball. And now they're working on tactics here. Who's going to take it? There'll be a fair bit of time wastage in this first half, I think. Stephen Clark takes the corner to Graham Clark, but he's dispossessed by this man, Cahill. Takes a shot. A goal. Another goal, and that's 3-2. Well, well, these boys are certainly coming back. The other side of the pitch, we see Graham Clark with the ball. He's tackled, but he's still going. Working his way up, plays it to Steve, the brother. Across the one, but it looks like it's going out of play. No, it's kept in. This man, Carl, is dispossessed him again. Oh, David, David, David Carl, what a chance! Oh, and a fantastic goal, that one. Beautifully placed, so it's 3 3. What an exciting match this is. And the goalkeeper, Siobhan Moore, never really had much chance with that. It zoomed in, and no chance at all to get down on it. The footwork. David Carl is away again. And it's another goal. It's 4-3. Well, well, well. Straight from the tip off. Beat two men. And slotted past the keeper. Now we have a tip off here as the referee places the ball. And number nine, Graham Clark, tip off. Try and get his team back into the game again. Now, plays the ball to John Moore. John Moore lashes it back at Graham. And they're working their way up the wing. Kicking as fast as he can. Graham trying to get the ball, but he's been tackled by uh, Cahill. But he beats him. Plays the ball out. Now the ball working his way up. Now Stephen Clark with the ball. But he's dispossessed by David Carroll. And it goes across and an anxious moment for the keeper. As he holds on to that. And a bit of an argument now with the referee. He'll get himself booked if he's not careful. He's had several bookings this season already. And a sending off won't do him any good here at all. A corner. Stephen Clark to take the corner. 
chips it in. Oh, and it's just over the head of Graham. The ball now. And John Brown has picked up, picked up the ball, and that's handball. You can't pick up the ball. Now, Carl is taking the free here. Jesus, he nearly hit me. Stephen Fancy football this man Carl is certainly playing well. He's still going forward with the ball. He's into the centre, but a good, a good save by Siobhan. Now David Carroll. What can he do? A nicely played shot in the middle. Now Gemma has it. Gemma clears it. John Moore on the ball. John has tackled and it looks like it's a goal kick. Goal kick. Hey ref, open your eyes. Where did Jersey ref? <laughs> and the referee getting a bit of stick here now from the the commentary box and from the opposing goalkeeper down there. Oh, what a kick from Siobhan Moore. Wow. Right back to Paddy Carroll. Who takes a nice ball out to David Carroll. As Dave plays the ball. He's dispossessed by Graham Clark. Graham Clark moving around now on the wing with the ball. Playing it well, crosses it into the centre, and this is. Carl has the ball again, working his way up. Beating several players, plays the ball in, but again, another good save by Siobhan Moore, who feels it out. Carl again. And back to Siobhan Moore in the net. They're behind, behind the goal, which Harry Card is keeping. Here's Graham Clark, he's dispossessed. And the ball is going way off the field altogether. So an interesting game with the score standing I think at 4-3 at this stage and we must be approaching the half time. Star players of the game so far would be this man Cahill I think who's playing a blinder and uh, also young David Carroll and Graham Clark featuring very much in this game and Stephen as well playing very very well. He tries a little chip but intercepted by Cahill. Carl is working his way around. Thought he was going to hit an, an OG there for a second. But he's on the ball. Oh, and a good shot. Oh, and that's another goal. Five, get, five goals to three. And there's the half-time whistle. A very entertaining first half indeed. The team's taking a, a half-time break. The well break. Yeah, you can still revenge in the second half. There's my assistant cameraman there, who's not taking oh, part in the game. Oh, come on, come on, here, yeah! I'm not sure. Would you be able to do ref? I know some of the players who didn't get much of the, the ball in the actual game are having a little kick around themselves. That's little Gemma and John Moore. Stephen Clark looking a little bit dejected at half time. And we'll have to try and rally around to the second half here and pull the game back. We're out to get underway. And can the Cabantini team from Town Euro do something about this? Walking away. But Dave Carroll is on the go again. And a good save by Siobhan Moore. An early attack in the second half showing that this team is intent on increasing the lead from five goals to three. Now Graham Clark on the ball. He's dispossessed. John Moore is on the ball. And there's dissent in the ranks of the, the park team, I think. Stephen, come on, take the corner, Steve. Come on. You playing? Stephen. And it's a corner anyway. And the referee is having problems getting this second half going as well as the first half. He's going to take the corner. Peculiar strategy this, but anyway, let's follow the ball. On, now Graham Clark has the Come ball. On, Can he do anything with it? But he's no support. He'd have to go it alone as he tries to beat Carl. John Moore is tackling him. He's on his team. Come on, Steve! 
Come on, Stephen. Come on. Come on, little friend. Come on. Oh, no. That's a Stephen. Stephen Clark. What are we doing? Right, I play with you, lads. No, no, no. And we, no, we just, we just, um, start to referee us all together, right? Well, we can see how now the referee is playing. Oh, Our team, right, there's two right, players right, down on the field. Oh, Look oh, out. <laughs> you don't do that. Get over there beside one. Oh, sorry. Bad kick out. Quickly oh, left on there by David Carroll, but blasted it wide. Did they get the energy? They get them to play. Jamie with the ball. John, what are you doing? You're with me. Huh? John, what are you doing? You're with me. You just take the ball off for you. <laughs> Come on, kick the ball out. Kick it out. Come on. Over to me. Just look to me. Oh. Come on, Graham. Now Graham Clark. The chance. Come on, Graham. The oh, keeper hasn't beaten. Go on! David! Back it! Back it! Back it! Back it! Back it! Uh oh! Referee oh, working yeah. well. Oh, keeper! Harry Carroll coming out now. Plays at the Carl. Oh, the day. Carl's going to chip it in, is he? I took it! I don't know where that went. Standing at 6 3 to the manor. Now Graham Clark tips off to John Moore, plays it back to Graham. Graham working with the ball now, playing well. Tackle by Carl, Carl working with the ball now, plays it in. And is it going to be cleared? Spectators on the pitch here. Oh, no, that was off the post. I know. So no goal, no goal. It was a kick out from Shivani Moore, but it's a bad one. And the man are attacking again. Oh, and that's another goal. Seven goals to three. I think I'll go on the other side. Why? Get off! Harley thinking of changing teams at this stage. We are two children. David, I'm going to say it's the other side. Oh, my God! Balance the odds a little bit. Now, will this make a difference to the score? Seven goals to three for the manor. Graham Clark tipping off. Plays it out to Parry Carroll, the new, trans new signing from the opposite team. He's working his way up the ball, but he's, he's dispossessed by Cahill again. Oh, and well beaten. But he's getting himself back into the game now. Now, now we've got a bit of bit of front runner. Graham Clark on the ball. Oh, has he got a chance? Yes. It's a goal. That's a goal. <laughs> well, they pulled one back and this new signing seems to be making the difference. Seven four it is now. Seven goals to four for the Manor. Against the Cabin Tahiti crowd. Jeez, me Harris Fox never told me where I'd be today. They kick off now. As they kick off again. It's your kick. And off they go. Graham Carroll. Oh, Beat by David Carroll. Oh, Graham is back in. Oh, David Carroll is on the ball. Oh, now Parry Carroll. Chips a high ball in, but well held by the keeper. Formerly the referee. Oh, no. Now, here's Graham Carroll. Graham working on the ball. Surely this must be a chance. Yes, another goal. Good goal by this man, Graham Clark. Putting his heart and soul into the game and getting the results now. So that's seven, seven goals to five. Okay, you're outside. Let's tip off. Here's Cotton now. Well saved by Siobhan Moore. And the ball is breaking loose. Right, Craig, get me that goal. Party Carroll. 
dispossessed by Carl. But it's gone. Goal kick. Again, the man of town breaking. And it's gone again. Another wide. Go on, keep playing the game. Yeah. No. Now there's a cross ball coming in here. Oh, nice and well done, well blocked there by Graham. Gemma! Gemma! Oh. 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 That's gone wide. That was a sit and dope miss there. And the kick out, the ball goes to Graham Clark. Dispossessed. Cahill working his way up. Oh, yes. And that was a good goal. That was a good goal.
What's the score now? 11-7. 11 11 11-7. With a couple of minutes remaining. And a bit breathless after that stint in goals, conceding two goals in a very short space of time. But now David Carr on the ball. Beaten by his father. Bullet. Now Graham. A chance. And no luck. Now Charlie Card again. Oh, that's a hard shot. And there it is, a great goal. A fine goal there from Graham Clark. As this man walks away, perfectly satisfied with that fantastic goal. So now, can they pull it back? Well, it remains to be seen. There's only a couple of minutes left. And the Manor team look like they probably will hold out. And that's about all the time we have here. And we have to leave the match because the battery is running out. So it looks like a win here in the park for the Manor team against the Park Cabin Well, you know. There's Robert who didn't take part in the game. Substitute. And also, Anya, who was sick and unable to take her place on the Manor team. Saved by the keeper. Now Graham Clark trying to get the team going again. Good scrappy match was beaten by David Carr. David Carr working through now. Oh, and it's in the net. A bad error by the keeper. Shimon Moore there didn't get the foot down, didn't get the body behind it. Oh my god, it's coming at the camera, man. I kicked it, David. Nice pass from Graham Clark to Pori Carroll, back to Graham Clark. And final no, touch, just not hard. David. Now David Carroll on the ball. Plays a nice ball in, looking for Cahill. And Cahill has it. Pori Carroll under pressure to defend here. Does so well, but he's beaten. Up, and that's gone into the net. Another goal from Cahill. Blasting it past John Moore. But really, poor old John had no chance. Oh. And that's the end of the game. Full time. What of an exciting match that was. Yes, great. The final score, 13 8. But on a day like today, I think everybody was a winner.
There's an old camera here. Look. Camera rolling. So yeah. now as the teams retire to the the dressing room for a bit of refreshment after a very tough game. And a couple of casualties really in that game. Stephen Clark had to cry off just prior to half time with a hamstring injury. Then uh, John Moore retired with an ankle injury. But all in all, a good day for the game of football. Let's see, I don't know what to do. Home late. Huh? And everybody taking a while here and rest after that marathon game. Tuesday the day of school opening for everybody. I won't get the books now because I have to go home this evening. All right, Annie. We heard what Stephen said. Dad, Mike, you're wrong. I'd say she's over the worst. Dad, you're wrong. We buy some seven up. Dad. I think we got the best coat. Dad. 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 Jane is supposed to come out. Why? 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 She was saying to Kai, she was saying to her dad that she take Gary was polishing his feet. And he said it was only the driver's yeah. seat and she could take it. Yeah. Not very happy girls, are they? Only a driver's seat in the car. Yeah. yeah. Well, well he is now. He took out the other clean. ones to scrub it. Oh, yeah. Talked about the teams in the distance after the game. Oh, back to the